Putting it in a mail, some people are just not comfortable with taking their ballot and then and putting it into the hands of the post office to deliver to the polling stations or wherever they do count the ballots. So the bottom line is there is another option. What you can do is simply go to one of the polling stations and go to the front of the line, show them that you have your uh, envelope, and then they will let you in to drop it into a box. Um, they said it was going to be about an hour um, in the line, so we decided we really didn't want to wait in the line. Both ladies wanted to vote in person for the experience, but the line was long, too long, thanks to a computer glitch at the Silver Springs Recreation Center in Henderson. Good thing they came prepared. They brought their mail-in ballots with them, and when they decided the wait was too long, they started filling them out, knowing they didn't have to drop it off in the mail. Just go right in and drop it off. Nice option if you remember to bring your mail-in ballot with you to the polling station. For this woman, casting her ballot was special. It's her first time, but with a baby on the way, she knew she didn't want to wait her turn outside to get in front of the voting machine. The line was just so long. So, so she exercised her option by filling out her mail-in ballot. It's no big deal. Over at the City of Henderson's senior facility on Racetrack Road, the line was even longer. But here there were no computer problems when we were there. And people managed to cast their ballots the traditional way or by dropping it off just like this couple. At the end of the day, whether you vote in person, mail your ballot or drop it off. Just as long as I vote and get my vote in, that's all that really counts. And that's really all that everybody really wants to do, make sure that their ballot, uh, their vote is counted. Now, if you do want to drop off your ballot, uh, you want to take out your sample ballot that you got here in the mail with your name on it. You can go inside, see where the poll polling uh, centers are, and then just head over there. And again, all you got to do is go to the front of the line, wave your envelope that you've already filled all of the information inside, and they'll let you in to drop it right into the container where it will be counted. Reporting live, Les Criffin, Fox News Local, Las Vegas.